2016 developed on release by Walt Disney Animation on distributed by Walt Disney Pictures was the feature film of Moana. The computer-generated film was an original story all through extensive consultations of cultural experts from the South Pacific region of the world. From a budget of roughly 175 million US dollars, in terms of ticket sales earned a revenue of 645 million US dollars. Also, the film was publicly applauded for the story on rich characters depicted within it. However, upon its release, cultural rights groups of Maori, Hawaiian, on Samoan backgrounds all complained that though the film was a spirited adventure on worth watching, it didn't accurately depict any single culture of the region on essentially mixed and merged them all together into the generalized Polynesian portrayal seen within the film. One of the most complained about in terms of details for the film was the character of Tamatoa. The film was unique in the fact that it mostly focused on that of Moana on Maui. But due to circumstances within the animated feature, they were the only characters that interacted with one another for most of the computer-generated feature. When Maui decides to get his magical hook back to help Moana complete her quest, it's mentioned that through events not depicted in the film, that the giant crab of Tamatoa hauls it and Maui needs to retrieve it, which they do. Particularly, Maori peoples of New Zealand took offense to the portrayal of Tamatoa from the fact that within their own mythology and culture, Tamatoa was a vastly different representation than what was shown in the Disney film. When the film started and Moana's grandmother recited the tale of Maui, and when he stole the heart of Tefiti, he was stricken down by the demon god of Teka, and lost the hook and banished to an island for a thousand years. During this time, Maui supposedly had an unseen feud with Tamatoa, on the card was inserted into the film as a plot mechanism for Maui to retrieve the fishing hook, as well as to explain to viewers his then dependence upon the magical hook for his powers as well as his own confidence and self-esteem as a warrior, and to have a minor villain be the focus of the feature until the final battle against Tekar later in the film. Critics have mentioned that if the Tamatoa scene was removed from the film, there wouldn't be that much of a change within it. Commentators have also said that Tamatoa was essentially inserted into the film to help explain or display more Polynesian culture to viewers due to the fact that all the audiences saw of Polynesian culture was at Motunui, Moana's home island, On most of the film takes place during the voyage to Tefiti's resting place. Even upon being asked by Moana, Maui commented that it was an annoying detour and somewhat did need to be done if Maui had retained his fish hook, but as mentioned due to unknown details, Tamatoa had come to Harvard and Maui needed it back for the fight against Teka. Even if it were to be explained which it was during their confrontation, there were more details that were not explained. When Maui and Moana escaped Tamatoa's lair with the fishing hook, the crustacean was left on his back and complained about the situation as the pair didn't care in the slightest about Tamatoa's situation, and the fact that it was a fourth wall reference to unfair treatment or comparison with Sebastian from The Little Mermaid, as Polynesian rights groups as well as audiences didn't really quite understand why would Tamatoa make a reference to Sebastian even if they were both crabs? A character can be overrated yet hated because they weren't needed for the plot, but inserted into the story to help audiences understand a foreign culture. 